and we've never been here before and it's located in Tampa so it's about an hour or so drive for us and I'm really excited let's go ahead and go on in He's the expert. Uh, all right. Well, we're going to use two fingers. Touch right here at the top of the belt. Just don't go past your wrist and wait till they're right side up. So, like, that would be a good one. You're just going to go nice, gentle touches like that, okay? You're doing it, Mama. I haven't gotten them yet. Uh, not yet? You can reach down. Send not past the wrist. Well, yeah, yep, just don't, like, dunk your, your dunk your hand in there is what he's saying. Are these moon jellies? They are moon jellies. There's one right there. They're beautiful. I love how they move. Oh, got right behind it. He's right side up. Should be able to reach. Mama, this yeah, one. This one There's this a better one. Yep. There you go. Oh, that's there so you are. <laughs> Very cool. <laughs> okay, right, take two. Oh my gosh. Somebody. The water's cold. Yeah, we can keep this at about 60 degrees. Oh, that's really cool. Very cool! They're beautiful. Is there, oh, there's sanitizer. Yeah, okay, right perfect. I just want to make sure I wasn't dropping no. jelly water. <laughs> okay, thank you. You're welcome. So we're going to walk through the underground spring, the spring-fed stream, Florida River, mangrove tunnel, mangrove forest and the bay shore. This is the path that we're going to take as we go through Florida's wetlands. I think this 
is the same sign that was out in the front. So mom and I have been here. Everglades. We've been all the way down here. And Key West, yep. Looking but there's a lot, yeah, even like Lake Kissimmee. You know, because, you know, in Orlando, there's quite a few. where I was yesterday. Rainbow Springs. This is where, this is what the lady at Disney was saying, that the water goes all, the lake is in the go this water goes all the way to like, the children. Yeah, actually. Yeah. And that's what the Walt Disney Preserve is. Well, you can visit floristateparks.org. It's a reflection. It's the alligator snapping turtle. Oh, that's a big turtle down Yeah, he's a big boy. Now what's funny, look, is he has toenails on those three and barely a toenail on that pinky toe. I know, he's cute. Let's not eat it. So cool. me to come look at the spoon bills. They're really pretty. And he said I had to look at the conductor's little shy one. So rosette spoon bill. And he's filter feeding. That twig, get out of here. Their beaks are very flat. Yeah, and very thin. There's another one right there too that's beautiful. Very pink. And clearly they can fly. He's like, excuse me. 
Excuse me. Get off my branch, man. I mean, we are so close to this exhibit, you could literally reach out and touch them. Right. It's Which nice. don't, I but don't, yeah. But yeah, they are very close. I don't know what that one is back there, behind the, the log. The gray guy with the... Yeah, he's kind of got like white markings on his face. I don't see any sign for him. He's really cool though. This little one, the little white one in the back is puffing himself out because he doesn't like that spoonbill near him. So that was kind of funny to see. But we're just following along this path. Still in the wetlands of Florida exhibit. I think it's going to lead us though up, up there. Good shot of him filter feeding. So cool. The exhibits over here are beautiful. Wow. And that stuff, I mean, we just don't see, you know? Some jumped out. It looks really cool. That's what you see before you hit the beach. Red drum. Yeah. Woo wee. Kind of. Red drum because has a little red on the back. Exhibit. Whoa, he's turning around now. He's like, you want to take a picture of me? Let me pose for you. Hi, beautiful. You got a big old beak, my friend. It's like a big fingernail on the end, huh? That's so cool. What I was going to show is that they've got this whole exhibit lined down here that talks about turtles and tortoises. So these are some... Yeah, that's why we didn't stand that close. He pooped. Well, he's an animal. That's what he does. There's one inside there, though, too. It's really cool. He's also looks like he's got a fingernail on the front. I mean, it must be to help him grip. No, he's back. Look at these guys. Yeah, the cars. Reflections in there because of the sun. Oh. Wow, there's here. Are those little teeth? Yeah, they look like little teeth. They sure are. Long nose car. See, Mama? That's why they have that little hook on their. I think. Frogs and fish, wow. <laughs> Uh, 
that sake. Oh, okay. I don't see the Florida sea cucumber either. What are you looking at, honey? Ah, garden of eagle. Oh my gosh, they just poke out of the sand. Mm -hmm. And those are two dwelling and then the pink ones. It's cute. Mm -hmm. Cute. I love it. This one. That's a sea star. He might be behind the coral. Target for him too, so yeah, that's his target. Right. Just how they train the octopus. You think he's under there, under yeah, the coral? I mean, they a sea star. A lot of I don't know. I don't see him. But what's cool is they have a whole water lab over here. Some bottom dwellers. Seahorses. Seahorses. There's the water lab. Which is very cool. I love the seahorses. The Florida ones are cute. Having fun? I love Having fun? Having fun? So far, yeah. Let's look at the seahorses. They have a line seahorse and a spiny sea star. Look at them! They're just so peaceful. Precious. Their face and do not touch their back. In about five minutes, I do have to put these animals on a no touch break. So get your touches in while you can. Two fingers on the wing tips, do not touch their face or their back. Thanks so much. Give you a point of reference that's the moon jelly exhibit so if you come down this way there's an avian research station it looks like they're handing out some Swedish fish so that must be a sponsor that this aquarium works with we're going to go into the coral reef exhibit I think next yes this is so fun this has been such a nice peaceful day it's very chill even at parts where I feel like it was busy, it still wasn't like super busy. Closer. Yeah. They also have, there. yeah. They also have the Mosaic Center, which is a se center separate area that they've set up for conferences and weddings, which I think is kind of cool. Let's check it out. Okay. Uh, I want to go in there. Florida's coral reefs. That was terrible. The most days aren't like that. Gracie, look at the big turtle. Mm -hmm. Look at that big, that big mouth. Yeah, yeah, it's swimming around all. Very cool. Let's get some information about Florida reefs as well. So that one's called the porcupine fish. They also have a squirrel fish, harlequin sea bass, there's a ray, Atlantic spade fish, doctor fish, blue tang, and an ocean surgeon fish. Blue tangs are so pretty, they're so little. This is 
a continuation of the same tank. Those are cool. They look like they're just super wispy. Oh. I got some. These pickles are a little. They are like tangled with each other, almost. For sure, it's got a little food, something. Wow. Cool, yeah. The carpet in here is cool. Yeah. All that upside down jellies. Upside down jellies. Oh my gosh. Just looks like coral. Holy cow. The, the ones with the different colors, the blue and the gray, and there's some green over there. That's pretty. Upside down. These just feel like big old sea, sea grass blades. Silfen, Spolten, Spolten, and Ten Point Gunnels here. Cool. Tide pools. They live off the U.S. Pacific coast from Alaska to California. Just in between the files. Yeah. And there's some... Um, Clownfish. Nemo! This goes like all the way up to this kind of cool filter thing. It's Australian spotted lagoon jellies. They're so tiny. Really pretty. I like 
like this too. These are the flower hat jellies. <laughs> flower hat jellies. The flower hat jellies are cute. Wow, look how cool this is. So we just heard diver Dana is about ready to get into the water. And you can see the man-made coral trees. So they take bits of coral and grow them and then put them back in the water to kind of rebuild some of our coral reefs. There's also a loggerhead sea turtle along that big window there. Is she coming down? Maybe not. This is Katie's cow right here. Yeah, I was hanging out with that fish for a minute. Oh, she definitely. All right. Hey, Dana, we hear you loud and clear down here. Looks like you're getting ready up there. Yeah, you should be able to see me soon, either through the window or through the monitors up above. Yeah. The cameras are not working, so we'll see you as you get into the water. Now, while we're waiting for her, uh, anybody know what this big light structure is? But there's a gecko in here. 
Oh, nope. Under renovation. Abel found the husband chair. He finds the husband chair everywhere we go. This exhibit is tight in here. It looks like there's for people to sit and wait. Is the lemur straight down, do you think? You see a Dory? Dory is there. Yeah, I do see Dory. I'm gonna try to get us past there. Hello, Prince Julian. Hey, Mary, the turn us down. Yeah. Okay, can you get him? He's on a move. They move kind of fast. They really don't move that slow. They lie. that they do that. People said this is where they have quarantine tanks as well for animals that need to be separated. So either they bring them from a different facility or, you know, so they're okay. Mom's making her way to this overlook. It's really cool. Yeah. Wow. wow, it's very expansive. fun another thing I wanted to touch on quickly because I didn't film this process but I wanted to let you guys know when you arrive and if you are a Florida teacher you just need to bring your Florida DOE number your teacher identification number and you do get a discount off of tickets um, so that was a great help to us since we were buying three adult tickets it did bring down the price a little bit but I loved it I definitely would love to come back again um, Ava what did you think I loved it you loved it yeah I'll definitely come back. I want to do that penguin experience. Yeah, they have um, a lot of different backstage tours as well. Mm -hmm. So they're, aside from just the exhibits, which is what we did today, there's a lot of other things to do. So I think that we can definitely come back and try some of those. I agree. Okay. <laughs> but if you enjoyed, please give this video a like, subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye.